Hello everyone. So today in this tutorial video, uh, what I'm going to show you is how to wire up uh, either AC or DC 8-pin uh, relay to the base. So uh, first most, I have here uh, an AC relay. This is a, a 240 volt AC relay and I also have a 24 volt DC relay. And I also have one base, so just take note, you can use this base for uh, both AC and uh, DC relays. So first, I'm going to hook up the uh, DC relay. So for this, um, what I have over here, this is actually a AC-DC converter. So it converts uh, 240 volt AC to uh, 24 volt DC. So I'm just going to plug this up to my wall socket. Okay, and you can see my uh, AC-DC converter is uh, plugged and it's working. So, just switching that off for a while. Now, let's go on to the relay configuration. So if you look at uh, both the AC and DC relays, you can see they are both 8-pin. Uh, what I'm using is a double throw relay. So if you look at the configuration of the relay, this is uh, the AC relay, it's similar to the DC. Uh, on the left, we have pins 1, 5, 9, and 13. On the right, we have pins 4, 8, 12, and 14. I'm not sure if you can actually see that, right? So I'm just going to hook this up to the base. nice and firm in the base now for the wiring in the base uh, just take note it's the it's opposite so I have 1 5 9 and 13 on the left on the left so over here the pin configuration would be 1 5 9 and 13 all right that's <coughs> on the right side now on the left side, I would have uh, I have four, eight, four, eight, twelve. If you can see over here, twelve and fourteen. All right. So what's important over here? Uh, pins thirteen and fourteen. These are the ones that's actually going to be uh, sending the voltage to the relay. So here I'm actually going to connect this up. To the DC source, so I'm going to use the DC relay. I'm just going to unplug this. Plug in the DC relay. We're good. All right. And now I'm just going to insert the DC relay. Power up the DC relay through this AC DC converter. Okay, um, we can see now that I've uh, wired up the DC relay to my AC DC converter uh, right over here. This is my life and neutral going in, and this uh, for the AC, which is going to the power cord and to the wall supply. And I've got my negative and positive of DC 24 volt, uh, which will be supplied through here to my relay. So let's power this up now. Right. So you can actually see, have a close look over here, that right now my relay is operating based on pins 5 and 9. 5 and 9 are now giving a close contact and I'm just going to release the power so just see that relay uh, flipping right so that's the part for the DC relay now we're going to connect up the AC relay okay I've connected up my AC relay uh, to the wall socket is going through this cord right so i'm going to power it up now and you can uh, look at the flipping of the relay
Now you can see the power is on now and it's actually moved to the, uh, the position. You can actually even see the light over there. So we're going to switch it off. Switch it on. You're seeing a bit of flickering of the light due to the camera, but uh, it's actually on a stable state right over here. So you can actually, uh, it's the same as how the DC relay was operating. You can see right now there's a close contact between points 5 and 9 and also uh, 8 and 12. I'm going to just flip the switch again. One more time, I'm going to power it up. I'm going to switch it off. Right, so it's about the end of the tutorial. So just remember, um, the bottom two points 13 and 14 are for your either AC or DC, depends on your relay for your uh, voltage to come in and if you actually want to use this relay in a normally uh, you're going to connect this up to a normally closed circuit you would be using points 5 and 9 or 8 and 12 if you want to use this in a, in a normally open state uh, you'll be using points 1 and 9 or 4 and 12 right so that's about it for now uh, do hit me with uh, comments if you have any. Thank you.